This is Sam. It's December 14th. It's about 1.30 p.m. in the afternoon and uh, we're in Bryce Canyon National Park in Utah and uh, we're out here enjoying the beautiful day. It's a little bit cold out here. Um, it's about I think it's like 20 degrees or so. Maybe 30 if we're lucky in the sun and uh, it's been a fun journey. We can't really do much hiking today because of all the ice on the trails. Uh, if it was just snow we would just deal with it but it's ice and uh, ice is very slippery, so. Uh, shall I tell the folks about what happened this morning? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So this morning, it was the coldest it's ever been in our poor trailer. It actually got down to the single digits. I believe it got down to about eight degrees, which was mighty cold. And when we woke up this morning, we had a couple of issues. Uh, one of them was our water was frozen on the inside of our trailer, which means we didn't have any running water this morning. And our inverter stopped working, so we didn't have any electricity. And so now we gotta sort these issues out and uh, figure out how we're gonna charge our laptops, our cameras, uh, our cell phones we could just charge in the car, but yeah. Not having a working inverter means we can't use like regular power unless we hook up to a campsite, so. Do you have anything to add to that, honey? No, I think that's, you covered all of it. No, so no electricity. Our water should be back up and running by the time we get back to our trailer. But um, yeah, things just don't go accordingly to plan all the time. And um, you know, luckily we had propane this morning and uh, I had the foresight to put fresh water in our pot. So we had coffee. Of the night, your touch used to be the color of the truth in our lives. Golden boy, you set my world on fire. You made me regret my desire. feel being on top of the world it's pretty amazing this is like one of the most insane views ever yeah and it's terrifying coming up here but I mean this is like the spot we still have like a little bit more to go and I think we're gonna do it 
it's a bit more nerve wracking on the way down, I mm. think. So Haley likes to take her time, and so she's like, oh, let's stop here on the side of a cliff. <laughs> And let wobbly people walk past us. I'm all for her taking her time on certain things, but walking f cliffside to a thousand foot drop is not on my to-do list. No. Actually, it's more like 1,500 feet. So. Yeah, it's, it's up here. Yeah, I'm glad to be standing on this very flat ground, <laughs> which is the it's flattest a big, surface. It's a pretty big space up here. Yeah, it's pretty big, and I'm happy to stay right here and not move anywhere at all. <laughs> <laughs> Hey. So we're nearing the end of our trip. We're going to be California again soon. Yeah. And we were discussing a little bit about maybe plans when we get back into the state. Do you have any input on uh, how you feel about going back to California or back to Sonoma County or anything like that? I mean, I, I'm really excited actually to get home uh, and see family and friends. As, as fun as this trip is, and as much as I'm enjoying it, it'll be really nice to like go home for a little bit and you know, just be in places that we're familiar with and around like people that we love. Um, I, you know, I'm very close with my mom who's back home and I'm excited to see my brother and the in-laws. And, and then all my friends um, who have recently had little ones that I'm really excited to meet. Little babies? Little babies. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mm. And I'm also just excited to, like living small these last almost four months has really been a big shift for, for myself and I think for Sam Mew as well and just kind of wanting to get home and really start like letting go of a lot of stuff and just focusing on the things that are really important to us and that we really love. And then, you know, kind of excited to think about what we want to do from there and what kind of a home do we want and where do we want to be? So I'm excited for that. Good. And excited for a little bit more travel, too. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. You're still recording? Yeah, I don't want to miss anything. Oh, okay. So, welcome to Zion. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty up here, but don't look down. <laughs> if anyone's afraid of heights. Like you? Yeah, <laughs> just like me. <laughs> Uh, I'm a getting a little down. nervous with you actually hanging the camera over. Yeah, at least we could film the drop until it exploded into a thousand pieces. Yeah. That's yeah, pretty hard. 